Welcome back in to the, <laughs> to the Casticlism Weather Channel. Today's forecast is looking like an increase in spoilers and a high chance of negative comments about this game. <laughs> Guys, what's up? Welcome back into the channel for part one of The Last of Us Part 2. And I'm so... <laughs> I'm so happy to be playing it and I know you guys have been excited to see it but like a lot of things same thing I had this hesitancy with starting the Walking Dead season four I don't like when things end and I also I just there's been so many mixed not messages but just mixed opinions about this game and I guess it's led me to just not just like part of me is like all right figure it out for yourself which side are you gonna fall on and so I've had a lot of people just recommend it and say that it is truly one of their favorite games and then on the other side you have people that are like this is the worst thing ever blah. <laughs> like super aggressive and it's like all right well I'm never gonna be able to form my own opinion until I get out there and play it for myself. And so, look, I don't have to explain it a lot. I hope you guys saw the trailer react because that's where I did make a lot of my, I guess, uh, predictive analysis, if you will, on what I expect the game to kind of go in the direction of or what I think it could do with the characters or where we're headed. I sense sadness, things are gonna get darker and harder. And I also am like, based on the trailers, we're going to deal with Ellie and I think also this growing um, like brutality in her. Like we see her go really, really hard in this game and that's not a bad thing. I just wonder how it's going to have long term impacts on her and the people around her. And the other thing, just, you know, in case you didn't see it, is I really want to know if that lie that Joel said at the end of the first one comes back to haunt him, because as we know, things buried beneath tend to find their way to the surface. And so I do feel like that's going to come to light. And I just really think the fireflies are coming back as well. So that's where I'm at. With that, y'all, as always, I hope you guys enjoy this episode and welcome back in for the first part. All right. Oh, you guys know the deal. We're going for that balanced experience. I'm trying to enjoy the game, not hate the game. Don't look at me like that. Ah, uh, pre order bonus. I don't know. Yeah. Camera assist. I think we're good to go. All right. Moderate. Yep. Yep, 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 yep. A boat. Interesting. Hmm. I actually don't think I ever really stopped to reflect on the significance of the starting scene in the first one. And now we have moth. Moths. Hmm. Oh, it's the loading screen. <laughs> I see. I really, I, I, it's not that I want to like it. I just hope that I still have the emotional connection with all of them. But based on how I responded to the first one, I think it'd be impossible for me not to still have it. And not at all. <laughs> I'm waiting for Joel's voice. <gasps> Guitar. I don't know what happened. <laughs> I'm supposed to take her to the fireflies and walk away. A Taylor guitar. You go halfway across the country with someone. A whole year or she more. She needed her immunity to mean something. I was starting to buy into that old cure business. Maybe I just wanted to do right by her. Is that Tommy? And then we made it. We found the firefly. Because of her, they were actually going to make a cure. only catch it would kill her Jesus. doctor what are you doing I, I won't let you take her this is our future think of all the lives we'll save not 
Okay, yeah. He's Jesus telling Christ, Tommy after yeah. it happened. What do you do? He didn't do it. I saved her. Did you just see the look in his eyes right there, though? Like... Oh. That determination and just... Doing whatever it takes to get her out alive. Come on, baby girl. All in an like all in the expression of his eyes. <laughs> I just. Don't let him get away. Left a few bodies in our wake. But wow. a lot. What does Ellie know? I told her they just ran some tests. Mm. I told her her immunity meant nothing. <sighs> and she believed you? Didn't say otherwise. <laughs> we should head back. Oh, they must have been on a hunting expedition or something, maybe. Tommy's got that rifle. So he found a guitar somewhere, he must have. I didn't think it was possible for the graphics to be any better. <sighs> and now we have a guitar on our back. This must be where we bring it back to Ellie. Because this has to be really shortly after we come back and see Tommy. It's gotta be. Oh. <laughs> Did we kill these people? I just, I, I, I always look at the eyes, like that's, that's just a huge thing in games for me. I, I did that in, um, 2018, Kratos' eyes, I talked about it a lot last, uh, uh, part, but, I mean, just the way he looked right there when he asked him that question, chills, save us. Oh my gosh. Woo. No, I know you guys are going to say you always cry over just the silliest things. But you can't tell me that that is not the most beautiful sight. This is a game. This is a game. I do feel like there's a lot more detail in the trees from what I can tell. Even in the mountains from the distance, I feel like it's a million times more um, detailed. <laughs> That's a r okay. So we've got like they've restored their power, which we kind of knew about at the end of the last one, but they've got a really nice setup there. Although it is in the valley, so everybody else around them would have the high ground. So rabbits and the. You got it. I'll never forget our other horse, though. I might forget the name, but I'll never forget the horse itself. Hmm. Teton Village. The Grand Tetons, baby. Dear.
That is dinner. What do you mean? Wait, let's go see the gas prices real quick. Hold up. <laughs> oh, something 94 cents. That's funny. They don't let you see the actual number, just the cents. Coast. Jackson, another place I need to go. A diner. Wow. Honestly, that American flag is still in incredible shape despite the years. Yep. Yep. I feel like right now it's a little bit of a quiet spot for the game. As far as his voice goes, he's very soft in his voice right now. Stop. Identify yourself before approaching gate. Can you hear somebody if they're yelling? I guess if they're yelling all the way out there. What is it made out of wood? They made the entire perimeter out of wood logs. I wonder, I wish they would tell us how long it took them to build this outpost. <sighs> Stables right at the entrance. It's okay, I got him. You go on. You sure? Yeah. Hmm. Right. We should see Ellie. About what we were talking about earlier. I can't say I'd have done different. I'll take it to the grave if I have to. I trust him, but... I'll see you later. I don't trust it finding its way out somehow, like some other. Or what if she finds out, like, throughout their journey? I don't know. Now I'm trying to picture it with the trailer, and I feel like the trailer had to have been such a misrepresentation. Oh, man. those converse that's what i'm talking about and they're not impractical they're not like these white converse in the middle of a post-apocalypse she got the walkman to work you guys Hello. ellie He looks so cute in his button down with the pockets. <laughs> There's a lava lamp too. Where did they find a lava lamp? <sighs> Jesus. This gave me a heart attack. I tried knocking, but. Hey. Hey. Oh. What's up, Joel? Just checking in. Folks are, you know, talking about how impressed they are with you and how well you're fart. helping out. It's good. Yeah. It's Tommy just and I went like... out riding the other day, and he. Uh, Told me a joke, and I, I thought about you. It's um. Oh shoot, no, I forgot it. Uh, something about a clock. How do you? Joel, it's uh, it's pretty late, and I gotta get up in a few hours. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know, and I'm, I'm gonna get out of your hair. I just um. I, I want to show you something. Just give me one second. He's so different, like in such a good way, but like he's trying so hard. She's the Starlight Magazine cover, by the way. What's this? The poster. Some folks call this thing here a guitar. A guitar. <laughs> Funny. You want to hear something? Okay.
They're going to start us off so... Promise me that you won't laugh. Won't laugh. So emotional. And then it's all going to be ripped away from us. I'm dressed in you. I was like, please take it over from here, please. <laughs> if I ever were to lose you, I'd surely lose myself. Everything I have found here, I'm not found by myself. Try and sometimes you'll succeed to make this Pain of me, all my stolen missing parts. I've no need for anymore. As I believe, and I believe as I can see our future days, days of. He loves her so much. There you go. Do you think he used to play that for Sarah, or do you think well, he wrote that for her? That didn't suck. <laughs> I'll take what I can get. She's yours. No, 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 I don't know the first thing I about this. I promise that I teach you how to play. You did. So what do you say, tomorrow night, first lesson? Yeah. <gasps> Don't look at me like that. I'm emotional because my dad taught me to play the piano. Okay. So it hits a string. Hits a chord. Okay. Do you remember the joke? Um. <laughs> what is the downside to eating a clock? Uh. It's time consuming. Okay, that's good. That's good. Yeah. Good night, kiddo. Kiddo. I, after this one, I want to figure out. I want to figure out why, like, there's so many jokes and that's a common thing. The Last of Us Part too. That's like a common thing. And so I wonder why, I mean, was it for comedic relief or like just to lighten the mood? Was it based on how they like talked about his personality? Like what, you know, because I, I just think that's such a small, subtle thing that they added and is so sweet. All right, so four years later. Hey. Morning. Sorry, I totally overslept. Just give me a minute and I'll get dressed. I heard you had quite a night after I left. Jeffsy. I... She kissed me. It was just Dina being Dina. She didn't mean anything by it. I was talking about your fight with Seth. Wait. <laughs> you kissed Dina? What? Oh. I thought this... We're broken up one week and you make a move on my girl? Ooh. No. Oh, she was probably just trying to make you jealous. I didn't. I would never. Oh, fuck, this is awkward. 
He's joking. I'm messing with you. Man. Yeah. I don't care. Get dressed. <sighs> You're the worst. That's kind of fucked up. You did that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it is so cute to see them. I don't know, like joking, like it just feels so normal, right? Like everything seems so normal. But all right, so we've woken up four years later. We're in the middle of winter and we know of a Jesse, which we did see in the trailers. And then we also know Dina from the trailers as well. Look at the Christmas lights. But I can kind of understand, like, I like that they started us off with Joel and showing us their relationship after they've been here for a little bit. It seems like it's been a few days, right? Um, and I don't know, was her reaction slightly because maybe she she feels like there's more to the story than he's telling? Or did they just, I mean, they had been on the run and the road for so long. So maybe when they settled back down, it was possibly like strange for them to resume this like father-daughter relationship in a way i think it was like they were trying to figure out and joel's trying to so tired trying to like navigate like not acting like her father while also still caring about her like one in a lot of ways oh first of all i see a lot of flannels and i'm here for it comics old clothes Oh, I have missed, I have missed the level of detail of Naughty Dog's games. And the flannels. She even got a TV. Like, look, there's even, she has a PlayStation. What is, like, they were able to bring back so much normality. Oh, look at the rabbit. Oh my gosh, look at the rabbit. <laughs> um, That just reminds me, like, whatever. <laughs> It's like rabbits are always around whenever I go back to Alaska. Even more comics. More comics. I love that. Comics. More comics. Even more comics. Overlord. What is that? Overland Saga. I wonder if, like, they found old DVDs. And it's actually pretty neat in here, too. Like, she's got a cool spot here. Beatrix Waters, open heart, 6.40 in the morning. I was hoping we'd be able to interact with the guitar or like get some kind of conversation piece out of it. I see a picture of her at Dean, Dina and Jesse, it looks like, and her horse, which means they got a camera too. And she has the moth. There's Starlight, horse. Is that a horse girl? I don't know, it was like a... All right, now we can sit down there. I just want to see how much, like she's got a tea kettle, she's got the fireplace. Can I pick that up? No. Gloves. She's got the futon. This is like such a cool pad, I don't know. An art easel too. Her jacket. Grab that gun. Tell me she's gonna put on more stuff. That's so... Sure. She looks freezing. I see pasta noodles, pasta sauce. Starlight's looking very uh, aggressive over there. Animals of the past. Like, where did they find all of this stuff? Like, so much of it is still intact. Ravioli. Grains. I see canned peaches. This is so cool. And she's got her shower and that's how she washes her clothes. Yeah, because you wouldn't have. I love that they included that detail because I would have wondered how she washes her clothes. <laughs> it's like the small things that they add to make it seem. Wow. Okay. That is like some of the best mirror stuff I've seen. I don't know. So where's Joel? Oh, grab the ship. Hey, is Joel up? Oh. That sucks. Shut up. I was just about to get up. All right, it's a switchblade, right? It's not a ship. You got everything? Yes. 
uh, four years later, she got her gloves on. This just still seems like I'd be having a beanie, <laughs> a scarf. I'd be freezing. Uh, I know we should follow him, but it, right off the rip, I'm like, are they going to throw us into gathering things? Let me see, actually. Yeah, so we already have materials, and then, oh, let's see what we start with in this one. Listen mode, movement speed one. <gasps> Hold on. You guys said that they're, you said that their mechanics are even better in this one. Plus 50% movement speed, too. Um, faster health kits, increased health. Listen mode two, endure. Otherwise, lethal damage will instead leave you at low health, giving you an opportunity to escape. All right, that's new. Crafting, faster crafting. Skill locked. Okay. Craft improved. Needs manual. Find training manuals to unlock new upgrade branches. And then we have a journal. Hmm. It's only this. Okay. Dina asked if I'm gonna take- <laughs> I'm gonna go to the dance. And she touched my arm. <laughs> I'm so delusional. Don't be an idiot. She's like that with everybody. Don't F up your relationship. Don't F up your relationship. I repeat, don't F it up. Tonight was crazy. I feel scared, elated, anxious. I just gotta sleep it off. So she finally got that kiss. All right, just double checking. It's a nice house, and they got a boat. Heads up, you're the talk of the town this morning. <sighs> what? Hmm? Let me see if I got this right. You kissed Dina. <sighs> she kissed me. Which triggered Seth to call you a not so nice word. Yep. Oh. Then Joel decked him. More of a push. And uh then you got mad at Joel. That part confused me. It was a strange night, man. She... Look at the greenhouses. Pumpkins? Wait, 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 wait. You guys know I gotta see the detail in this. Pumpkins, tomatoes. Oh. I do feel like she's just on edge with Joel in general. Is that squash? This is so cool. More tomatoes. There's a bunch of salt. Maria wants a word with you. Maria? Where is she? The diner. Turnips. This is about Seth. No clue. Okay. Just tell her you never saw me. <laughs> nope. Where's your fucking loyalty? What a great time. Excuse me. Staying up late. No can do. Hey. There are a lot of bags of salt. <laughs> So I feel like he's waiting here because it's allowing us to explore for a second, but I don't think there was anything to collect here, really. I wonder if you can... Okay, you can't, like, interact with people or anything. Hmm. I think we'll know when we're actually able to collect things. So we've got Maria. We still need to meet Dina. And this Seth. Hey, so... We're okay, right? You and me? Yeah, of course. Dina and I are done. Hmm. I know. It's just, I just want you to think. Ellie, we're cool. I promise. Yeah, I already get good vibes from Jesse. Thanks. But maybe I'm reading that wrong. Ah, that feels like an old saloon entrance. Barbecue, the clay pit, <laughs> Main Street Gallery. Wow. Oh. Gas for import. Oh, hi. Wow. Look at that. And they're making the hides. Wow, that's actually so true. They probably would stay really warm in the winter with all of the skins that they're getting. Trades, clothing, repairs. The tipsy bison. <laughs> all right, I want to see everything, though. We've got the blacksmith. Something rental available. <gasps> Look, check it out. We can actually. <gasps> oh, we're just gonna steal here real quick. <laughs> okay, so we can explore right now. Oh, that looks so good. What they really need to be doing is making some brick oven pizza. <laughs> oh man, look at the tools too. 
I feel like I'm I'm kind of hoping we see a section where like I guess it is winter so they probably halted building a lot of stuff but I also feel like they could have <gasps> hi hey old timer old timer good scratch old timer I love little scruffy dogs the banjo this is oh okay that woman did not like me interrupting their fire pit session <laughs> I just got oh look at the snowman look at all the kids that have been born let's hear it still has nightmares from that infected attack. So what is the right age for taking him out? I'm not sure. I just know our kids aren't ready yet. Mm. <laughs> They're trying to track where I am. Like, you can see, like, they're looking at me, but I'm just trying to eavesdrop right now. What is the right age to take the kids out? <sighs> That's a hard one to answer. Look at all these cowboy hats. The beanies. Hello. Yeah, it looks really cold. Oh, I do want to see the signs. The winter dance, 7 to 11 p.m. at the church. The two-step. The two-step. Lots of salt. I wonder if we're actually able to go in other locations? I didn't realize he was also following us. Ah, no. I wanted to go in there. Here we go. Let's look at the bulletin board. Help wanted, help needed. Moving horse supplies from the west to the east side of the stable. Tuesday. Oh, look. No way. Are our collectibles cards this time? Badass. Size Michaela. Size Michaela. Brains. Broad. The new dogs. <laughs> Wait, this is so cool. Affiliation, the new dogs. Michaela Ayari, Ayari discovered, first discovered her superpowers when she turned 13. With a stomp of her foot, she can send shockwaves rippling through the ground, knocking enemies off their feet, and in extreme circumstances, toppling buildings. Kicked out of the Society of Champions due to her potential for collateral damage, Size Michaela soon became the youngest member of the new dogs. She's a neutral villain. Ah, yes, the neutral villain. That's funny. It reminds me of, um, was it Magma from X-Men Legends or something? Help needed. We need someone to check on the horses on Friday. Okay, wait, we need to go to the other bulletin board. It might actually house another card. We're fixing a flat. We're just going to peep through the windows because we can't go in. Oh, wait, no, no, that is the diner that we can go in, right? Mm, no, it's not. That's the barbecue. Hey. Look. look. Hey. Who said hi to us? Oh, this woman? Hey, Ellie. Oh. I know, I know, but cards. Housebreaking Rufus. Movie night. Volunteers needed. Town hall meeting Monday, but no cards. All right. No luck. That's so cool. So I don't think we're collecting comics. I think we're going to be collecting those little, uh, I almost said Pokemon cards. Whoa, check that out. Wow. Quite the fox. All right, I see the dance thing here. We collected the bits and bobs right there, but hold up. <clears throat> My loot goblin nose is still working. Looking for 20 volunteers to help with repairs to the electric dam. When? First weekend in April. See Maria to sign up. That's probably what we're going through. If I had to guess, that's probably what she's wanting us to do. Also, though, that is an extremely big weak point for them. Um, you could cause a lot of chaos. One, they should have backup generators, right? Possibly. But if you wanted to, you know... Um, cause confusion and chaos. Cutting off their power supply would definitely be the first route to do it. Want to grab some breakfast? No. Where's Maria? In the back. 
in the back. Ah, we found the saloon. I do feel like a lot of people are looking at us on a lala beer and uh IPA. <gasps> now that's what I'm talking about right there. That rusted and lager. Yes. <laughs> Excuse me. Ellie, here you are. Come here. Maria. Seth's got something he wants to say to you. I don't want to hear what that bigot has to say. Do it for me, please. Oh, fine. Seth. Seth, come here. <sighs> oh, Seth is an old. Hey. Okay. It makes a lot more sense now. Uh, look, last night I was, uh, I was drinking too much. Sure. I'm trying to say I'm sorry. Well, maybe don't start with the excuse Marie and go with the sorry. Headed out. I, uh, made you some sandwiches. Okay. Your steak. Thank you, Seth. Yeah, well, uh, you be safe out there. Yep. I thought Seth was like our age, like Jesse and I's that. age. What you got there? Oh, bigot sandwiches. Mm. Smells good. They're yours. You sure? <laughs> it's fine. Let me walk you out. Okay. Okay. Can I explore a little bit more before we walk out? Oh, no, no, no. It, it definitely wants you to go out. Okay. Yeah, if you're not. Oh, no, we are able to move the camera. Hold on. Hmm. Yeah, I was thinking. Oh, look at all the watermelon. Wait, no, no, no. That's lettuce. Just kidding. It's iceberg lettuce. Okay. <gasps> yes, 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 yes. So Seth, yeah. So I was thinking Seth was going to be a lot younger. And now that I'm thinking about it, and you know, it went in my head when I was doing the trailer reaction video, when I saw the trailers, I think you actually see Maria in a couple parts that I assumed was Ellie and she was just older. <laughs> I just, I think it was, there was so much going on. And at first I was like, oh, it looks like, um, oh man, who was the first woman that we were traveling with with Joel? The Keen twin. Brains and Brawn, 8080. Here we go. Affiliation. Real names. Ophelia. Uh, Ophelia. And Xander. Okay, so affiliation none. And they're heroes. Born in a spark laboratory, the Keen twins were considered a failed experiment in heightening human senses. They were abandoned on the doorstep of an orphanage, but the forlorn pair soon learned of their abilities. Born deaf, Ophelia not only has amazing eyesight, but can see things on the infrared and x-ray spectrum. Born blind. Wow, okay, so it's flip-flopped. Born blind, Xander can hear for miles. No footstep is too quiet. No secret is safe. So long as they are together, they make for formidable opponents. But major weakness is needing to stay together because of that. But they are far on the hero spectrum. Love to see it. But yeah, that's a... That's... I don't know, that's a pretty big weakness for a hero to just... Although, I guess when you can hear for miles and see pretty much anything it might not be as big of a deal they've got nice glasses can't really read that maybe a little bit seth come by the store <laughs> come by the store later i'm about finished with the horse something you asked for those parts spare part and thank you for breakfast jeremy I mean, they've made it legible, so. Hi. I wish I could wave back at people. I feel like I'm not really friendly. Twin when sisters. You go out, I want you to trade off with Tommy and Joel. Those boys have been out for far too long. Where do I meet them? If you go up to the Northwest Lookout, they're scheduled to arrive later today. Watch yourself. There's too many sightings of infected recently. Really? Of course. I was going to check out the creek trails. I'll need someone else to cover it. Hmm. Ellie, you know the creek trails? Not really. Oh. Dina's done it a bunch. I'll have the two of them take it. Well, that solves that. Okay. She'll let us explore in a second, I think. Okay, real quick. 
I just want to run over here. There's the community Ellie, center. Can I talk to you for a sec? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bingo night, leadership meeting, line dance lessons. Oh, that's so cute. Okay. This is definitely where I would want to be if all of this went down. Oh, you can't go over there. But I do think there might be another baseball card. I'm calling them baseball cards. Hero cards. Um, I know we've already found two. That's cool. They kind of have like a library in a way. Eggs, milk, bread. And a movie theater too. Look, they painted the daycare. <sighs> The elephant. I'm sorry. Wait, no, no, the giraffe. I don't know why my head went to elephant. The giraffe. So cute. You know, just normal, just peeping through. Garden stable. They even did posts and signs. Our little daycare. The monkey. The hippo. Okay, before we talk to her, let's look at here real quick. I'm tracking, I see you. Student of the month. My name is Mary. Favorite color, pink. Favorite fruit, apple. <laughs> Check for frost on plants. Bleach toys. Fire safety. Bleach toys. Something play. Kinder play. Lost and Found has moved. Due to space issues, the Lost and Found is now located at the end of the main street. Hmm. In the buck leather. Free puppies to anyone that will take one. Yes, we will take a free puppy. Need trade ASAP. Child's jacket needed. Have men's boots. Town hall meeting. Winter dance. Hmm. Heather casserole. Bread. Drinks. Venison shank. That's pretty good. There's Dina. Look, whenever st what uh, whoever stole Japan's blanket, bring it back. He is getting cold. Don't be an ass, Dina. <laughs> that is, sounds so much like I get a sense of who Dina is just look, by these what's going on with you and Joel. pieces. Maria, guy really cares about you, and I'm sure he didn't mean to. We're fine. Hmm. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Sorry to pry. Sure you didn't mean to what? Be safe. Thanks. I got coffee Yo, mug Dina, after coffee mug. Right now. Just give me a minute. <laughs> we get your girlfriend to the stables, please. Oh my. Hey, Dina. Can I talk to you? <laughs> hey, oh. guys. And Dina. Hey, hey. Um, I just want to say sorry for running off last night. Oh, that's, it's okay. I totally get it. I, <laughs> I just, I felt bad. Look at her freckles. Why? Because I, I started the whole thing and I just, I shouldn't have kissed you in front of all of those people. I know, you were drunk, it's fine. Well, still, I just, I don't want you to think. No, I'm not reading into it or anything. Just... Mm. You know what I love about you? How you let me finish my sentences. <laughs> all right. Well, we should probably get going. Yeah. Ow! Oh! What the fuck? I'm not even playing! Because you're a chicken? Oh! I hate this kid so much. You want to fuck him up? You asked for it. You better run, you uh, shit. Holy shit. Oh, God. I, you guys don't with my aim. Oh, God. All right. Quick throw. Grab him, grab him, grab him. Are we going just for that one kid? Or are we trying to kill just... Not kill, but just go after... Oh, that actually worked. I was behind the pole. All right. Nice. I'm pretty sure... I'm being so... Yeah. Oh, he's right there. Uh huh. Mm hmm. See you. Smacked him. Oh, somebody else got me. Who was that? Oh, that little kid. Little shit. Come here. 
Mm, climb. Oh, gosh. Oh, you know it hurts when you do it right in the face. Right point blank. Oh. Okay, did I do it right in his face? I feel like Elf right now. Oh. Ow. I know where you... All right, no, no shot. No shot. Yeah. Also, they're not even dressed properly. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. He's up here somewhere. Oh! Oh! Oh, I just wrecked that... Oh! Just wrecked that kid in the back of the neck. Aw, they're so good with them, though. I guess I asked for that, huh? Yep. Let's go. She good with kids? <laughs> like the Chris- uh, not Christmas trees, but just like the lit up trees. It, uh, it looks so magical. So, Jesse wants us to do the creek trails. He's gonna relieve Joel and Tommy. Oh, that's nice he assigned us together. You're gonna like this route. Mm, I'm gonna like this route. Jackson Ranch. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Morning. Okay, nothing on there. Good morning. <gasps> Look at all the horses. <gasps> I'll bring them in. Thank you. Wait, this is so cool. Wow, look, they've even started to have cattle. That explains the large carcass, yeah. I was, like, wondering if they were just... I, I guess I was assuming they were deer. I didn't even see it as cow. Hmm. But no, yeah, because he had... He did say he had steak. Is he shooing him? Oh, <gasps> fuck. Oh, look at the bread. Oh my gosh, it looks so good. Dried tea. Ah, oh, Alpine Valley. All right, so this must be the groups going out. Look at all the... Oh, man. Hello. Oh, that would... Oh. That'd be so cool. I feel like if I had to have a job in this town, it would be working with the horses. But let's be honest, I'd probably be scooping shit. <laughs> so Joel and Tommy went to Teton County. Jesse and Mike are going there as well. So I guess they split us up. So yeah. And then Ellie and Dina were going to Elk Creek. And then Chad and Willie as well. Horseback pass. Okay. I feel like this is where that, you know, in the trailer when something bad happens. Got that. That's a good girl. Feeling. Who's here? Thanks. <gasps> what did she name her horse? Come on. I'm gonna know it's a universal horse, but like, maybe she has a name for it. Hey, Shimmer. Shimmer. Oh, look who decided to join us. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. One for you. Hmm. Would have liked the one with the scope, but I guess that's Tommy's. Open it up. Settle down, Joe. All right. You all know the drill. Run your routes. Mark your log books clear any infected you see. You run into anything you can't handle. You come back. Be smart about it. All right. Get going. Mm -hmm. So, where we're at right now... Yeah. The cheek click. I like that they're doing that to clear also to like, you know, slowly start clearing the infected as well. But I, I wonder, so I'm going to pause right there for a second. I wonder how many um, infected there would be at this point, because this was something I asked about in the first one. If infected are only previously people or is it 
growing? Is it growing? You know, like, cause I feel like the longer you go into this, the less and less infected there's going to be, but at the same time, cause there's already such a small population of survivors to begin with. So, I mean, yeah, I guess it would take a long time to clear out the total population previously that had turned infected. So you would see a lot of stragglers here and there, but I'm kind of hoping we get to see what they're like during winter time. Um, we've never seen if they slow down. I think, I don't think we saw if they slow down in winter. I can't remember now, but I feel like this is where we're going to see Dina die. That was my prediction, but I will be right back. Oh, this is the cabin in the trailer. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Oh, yeah, we are a group of four people, aren't we? Yes. That's not Abby. Oh, that's not Abby. That's not Ellie. That must be Abby. Mmm. <laughs> Is that Joel? Abby and Ellie look so similar. Like, I think it's just the, fr I think it's the freckles and the eyes that made me think, mu it must have made me think in the trailer that this was Ellie. It's hey. like. Hey. What were you dreaming about? Was I talking? Creatine. You're doing your teeth grinding thing. Where have you been? Grab your gear. I want to show you something. What? Trust me. Who are these people? Because I don't think they're on the scouting trip. Come on. This way. Her voice. Okay, there is a lot of confusion in my trailer then. <laughs> I just thought so many people were Ellie and there's multiple people. Oh my gosh. Okay. I bet you these are the people that do whatever it is that pisses Ellie off. Because remember, there was a voice and she was like, we spared you. Like we, we, sh and then Ellie's like, maybe you shouldn't have. So maybe this is them. But the game is a... It's cold. You sure you don't want to do this when the sun's out? And it's warmer? <laughs> no. Can't wait. And you don't want to just tell me? You need to see it. Is that a completely different VA? Because I maybe I'm just... I just feel like it sounds like the same person as Ellie's voice. I'm probably insulting it. I'm sorry. <laughs> I think it's like I gotta spend some more time hearing it. But even that grunt and the fall what sound. Are you doing wandering around out here by yourself. Been restless. You too. Mm. I feel like the farther south we go, the prettier it's gotten. Aw. You want to keep going? Just drive all the way to Mexico. Go this way. I've thought about it. <laughs> see Manny's hometown. <laughs> yeah, I don't see that living up to his stories somehow. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, no, probably not. Took this. The scenic route. Oh man. So I don't think the trailer was confusing. I think I'm just confused. You did all this in the dark? Yes. Now, come uh, on. Look at the just like the snow glints from the fresh snow. It is beautiful. Oh, they found the town, I bet. I bet you they found the town. I'm just gonna go over here for a second. Oh, you can go both routes? But what? Oh, look at that! The snow fell off of the tree! That looks so cool. They did such an incredible job with that. Okay, let me go smack it. We keep going like this. 
We're gonna be tired for today's trip. It's not that far. <laughs> it's hey, so not okay. She seemed out of it these past few days. She'll be fine. Belle. You stop being weird. You're freaking me out. I'm not being weird. Okay, hold on. We're gonna smack this. Uh, yeah, so you know how I told you that there was like a small spoiler that I had heard and it was just of the mention of like Abby's name. And I forgot about that. Like I know a lot of people are like Abby and Ellie. Now I'm obsessed with knocking all the snow off these trees. Trying to lighten their load. It's a little heavy for them. Yep, this is where we went through with the horses, no? Careful jumping over these. I feel like this is where Joel, yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh. Are you breaking up with Mel? <gasps> what? No. You wish. Oh. Uh, I've had my fill. Thank you. I just want to know what her workout routine is. I. Nope. Did not do that right. If you can do it, I can do it. Hold on. Said running sprint and jump. <laughs> Ouch. We can't all be as graceful as you. Now I've got freezing water on me too. What is that? You'll be fine. It's too high. Come on. Wouldn't they be able to see it by now? Shit. Hey. Eyes on me. Abby. Stop looking down. The focus? They <gasps> It's already this game is an art piece. Do we have to go back this way? Consider it an opportunity to work on your fears. How about I work my foot up your ass? <laughs> Abby, <laughs> stop flirting. <laughs> okay, I actually think they did some really good dialogue in that it doesn't feel artificial. Like, it feels like real conversations between people. Oh, yeah, this is it. Oh, yeah. Everybody has the same standard backpacks that they're given. Does it? We made it. Holy shit. It's a fucking city. Yeah. Have you told anyone else? I wanted you to see it first. Saw an armed patrol go from town to an outpost over there. A few more outposts in between. Oh, yeah. They have electricity, guns. It's a lot of people. We can figure it out. Okay. Assuming he's in there, how do we get to him? Yeah, Joel. We can corner one of the patrols and get confirmation, and then, I don't know, maybe find a way to lure him out. Yeah, okay. I'm sure they'll be happy to offer that information up. Well, then we make them. Oh, shit. You hear yourself? Okay, what do you want to do? What is going on with you? Mel's pregnant. Mmm. Mmm. Oh. Okay. It's not just that, Phil. Should I say congrats? When everyone else sees this, they're gonna want to turn back. We can convince them, right? Abby's father or somebody? I fucking knew I couldn't count on you. Somebody yeah. died? I want what you want. Not at any cost. Hey. Don't. See you back at the lodge. There were so many people that Joel's killed. Like, yeah, how... <laughs> Hopefully it gives us a little context of who it is. I'm trying, I'm like... Who of all the kills would have been significant? There were surgeons, there was the... Uh, the guys that he tortured and killed. I'm trying to think of cutscene kills. Fuck. 
Abby's just gonna go by herself? I'm making it... Also, what kind of... Okay, so I wonder okay. if the... Uh... I'll do the whole thing on my own. Okay, that's a poor idea to begin with, but I wonder if this is the start of where people are like, don't like this because you're playing like a portion of the people that are trying to capture Joel. I feel like that is a very artistically interesting way to have us go about playing this game. But I don't know how much we actually get to play as Abby. So maybe it's not as significant as we think. Like maybe we're just seeing things from her perspective. But I mean, we've gone through an entire game as Joel and Ellie. So it's going to take a lot to sway my opinion. <gasps> wow. Look at the way that they make you have this like fear of heights with that. Like this. Uh... <sighs> you guys were not kidding. It really does like that. game wise mechanics, everything. <laughs> it's beautiful. So with her, I can't seem to collect anything, so I don't think it matters nearly as much if I explore. We're also outside. But it does look like there's multiple ways to get there. Sure, it looks like it. All right, hold on, back it up, back it up. <laughs> oh, what? Okay, I gotta get a little bit more of a running start. All right, we'll do a little swing. Am I doing it too soon? Oh, okay, hold on. Maybe I need to, <laughs> okay, let's do this. All right, here we go. I, I was doing it too soon. I was pressing X just, oh, you've gotta be kidding me right now. <sighs> I'm starting to feel like that God of War scene. All right. Last minute jump, there we go. And don't back it up. I don't think Joel's already at that lodge. I don't believe. It's just a short hike. I think what I was gasping from was the realization that do you think Ellie is going to give up Joel for Dina? You know? I, no matter how angry she is at him. Oh, hold it to go prone. Okay. No matter how mad she is at him, do you think she would do that? Hmm. Oof. He got me pregnant. Tends to happen sometimes. Shit. She's gonna have to climb. No. Oh, infected. Yeah, see, look at that. That's why I was thinking the infected, how would they survive the cold? All right, that answers that question. They must have shot, uh, but there also could be two things. Maybe they were, they might have been surveying the area and they shot them and then they just freezed over. Ginger wants it. Oh, shit. oh. Like she really thinks she can do this on her own. What? Oh. Oh, oh. oh. Crap, we need to shoot him. You need to shoot him. Okay, the winter does not slow him down. Winter, <laughs> winter does not slow him down. <laughs> All right, I'm not really trying to see their... I'm not trying to see the Ellie Abby showdown that I sense is coming. I just sense it in my bones. I have to go that way anyway. Oh, sh- Dodge. Shoot, there's another one, there's another one. Hey! Get out of here. <gasps> oh 
Okay, now they allow me to have my gun. I guess I could have had it the whole time. My shoulder. Huh. All right, let's see. So they don't give me equipment, but like, they don't give me the same kind of... I guess she just doesn't have an inventory and you can't craft anything, but you can still have bricks and everything else. Flashlight. Against again. Oh, I was like, there's a floating tennis ball. The kiddie pool. Saws, paint. Also, honestly, it's a really nice setup for a garage, okay? It's a nice damn setup. Do you think this is the scene where we see it? Or like the area where we see it happen, like in this house? I could see her possibly oh, making this. Oh. All right, let's just check over here real quick. Hmm. No cushions? Somebody probably already looted the cushions, but I was like, they just had a wooden bench out here for people to sit on. We have to crawl prone. This is a bad idea, Abby. Can't see him. Reload. Okay, so I did want to say we never were able to go prone in the first one, too. So that's also something different. I like it. I think that's kind of cool. It definitely makes you have to be on the lookout for those kind of sections where you're going to do that more. All right, so I'll go back on. Ah, nice health kit. I feel so... It's like my... I don't like what it's doing to me already because it's like you're playing as her, so you have to keep her alive and you want her survival and you don't know her story yet, right? Like, we don't know why she wants this revenge on them, right? But it still makes you feel it's like a hard thing to work through for me because I, I want her to do the best she can to survive as we play her. But what if she is bad news bears for Joel? giving me, um, oh man, it's giving me the Shining Hotel vibes. Okay. It's gotta be close. Let's just check on this side real quick. Okay. Nice grill. Mmm. Oh, maybe she, oh, there we go. Oh, wait. Press it up and then squeeze. Team. Hold on. I think you have to be crouching, maybe. Oh. Okay, so I didn't know she could do that. Yeah, I had to be crouching to do it. Oh, shit. She has little sin mode, too. Stay crouched to sneak up on them. I know, everybody should have listen mode. If Joel and Ellie have it, then why shouldn't she? Nice. Okay, so that's also something cool too, and I'm interested to see if we... When Ellie goes to do stealth kills, will it be easier? Will it be the same style as Abby and Joel? Because if you remember in the first one, I don't think... She was never able to choke somebody out like that just because of her size and like her age and she was so much smaller but maybe now that she's more like closer to an adult maybe she can do the same thing as them now i don't think there's anybody else in here hmm. i wouldn't mind an extra health kit or no i'm maxed on ammo damn it bathroom health kit possibly oh the tiling. I don't know about that choice. A choice in tiling. Okay, nothing like that. There's so many stars. There's another bathroom. Hmm. That's those are two bathrooms really close, but I guess one was with the the main bedroom. 
But yeah, do you guys notice all the stars in all of these homes? There's a second one in here. We need to kill this one quick. Choke this one out. God, I've missed this combat. I just missed this, like... This is my challenge for this... This game is to actually be as stealthy as possible. Like, seriously work on it. Okay, he's all the way out there. He's gonna have to rotate where we could actually get a hit off on him. Ha. Huh. Do we have any bricks? Wait, that's so weird. The fireplace is like the cleanest looking thing in here. Okay, he's good for now. I wish we could... Ah, she doesn't have a brick, yeah. Worst case scenario, we can just shoot him, but... Kind of surprised they don't give us something like that. We can't get that sneak kill on him, you guys. I just feel like there wouldn't- I mean, he was facing forward. <gasps> I also knew that there wasn't anybody else around him, so it wasn't going to be the worst thing in the world if there was a loud noise. Hold on. Oh, yeah, yeah, that's right. Different house, different garage. But they all have the same tennis ball. <laughs> I just feel like this isn't a good idea for her. Turn back, let them be, and end the game here, you know? Shit. There should be more. They're giving us a lot of things to hide behind, yep. All right, here we go. Might turn around, that's the only problem. Oh! Well, that was damn close. Yeah, all the bodies must have been pre-killed before, and then they froze, because they don't seem to really be impacted by the winter. The weather's no big deal for them. Oh, shoot, is that a clicker? No. All right, we haven't encountered any clickers, but we've got two to our right, and then one, one at 12. I knew that, okay, that one left. We can silently take this one out. Yeah. <laughs> There should be one over there, though, too. Okay, and this one's gonna come back, so let's go around the other side. No, that one's walking over there. Yeah, I think there's one... Okay. Two left. Wait for the other one to rotate back to her position in the right side. I think. That's... She should. And then his normal rotation. Ah, oh, they're staying close together. Hmm, hmm, hmm. All right, this one's coming closer to us. I think I would have a better shot. Oh, yes, please come over towards us. Turn around. Walk this way. That one's turning around too, though. But I actually think if you kill them silently, the other one won't be alerted. We learned this in the first one. They're not like, especially when you do the stealth kill, the other one can't hear it. And they shouldn't be able to see it. So now I just have to get behind this one. We, uh, do we have bullets on that body, by the way? I love how I ask these questions, like y'all are here. I actually think we have bullets on that body, and so we might as well just get a little... Trying to be stealthy. Just re-up that. Please let that be it. Oh shit. Alright. Where's the road? Ah, uh, there's two different paths. I don't know if it really matters. I'm gonna go this side first. I think it's just two different routes to go to the same spot. This whole way has had two different routes. Did you notice that? Like on the climb up, like there were multiple options when we could go a different way. To still get to the same spot. Tracks. Hmm. Where's the patrol?
We could have kept you alive. <laughs> oh, we did keep you alive. All right, this should be their patrol. That's a Dina leg. That's an Ellie leg. That's an Ellie leg. <laughs> As soon as you see the green jacket, you know. Come on. This way. Right behind you. All right. Do you but miss being with him? With Jesse? <laughs> no. <gasps> Been together for so long. Look, Jesse's great. I love his parents. It's always like that. I love the parents. We will always be family, but we were just on autopilot. Fair enough. Hey, how come we never talked about this stuff? I don't know. It didn't feel... You never really talked to me about Kat. Who's Kat? Because there isn't much to talk about. Yow. Who's Kat? I, I got the impression that you didn't really like her. I don't care about her one way or the other. Ow. Okay. No, I think she's a talented artist. I've grown to like that tattoo of yours. Oh, she's the one that did the That's tattoo. So big of you. And I think she wasn't right for you. Huh. Interesting. Shut up. Okay. I think uh, that would be such a kick-ass business to have. I mean, being the tattoo artist of the town, that would be like high demand, I feel yeah, like. I Hmm. So, cat. You want to see something spectacular? You're going to point at your face, aren't you? <laughs> Nothing is that spectacular. <laughs> oh, oh, brother. Come on. Oh. Sorry. Hold on. <laughs> oh, is the allergies from the horses? <laughs> All right. Hold up before we see something spectacular. Y'all know. All right, just the locker. Mmm. Mmm. That sweet, sweet ammo. So we're not going to be collecting firefly pendants, I bet. So I what? We've got baseball cards. That's going to be one thing. There's got to be one more collectible, you know? Because we had the comics and we had the firefly pendants. All right, she's right through there real quick. Oh, yeah. Wow. Yes, it's optional dialogue. What do you think of this view, huh? It's pretty nice. <gasps> yeah, this route has its perks. Where are we sign in? <laughs> Come on. For some reason, I knew Dina's color for her name was going to be purple. It was just this. Oh, look at the bridge. So we have our bridge over there. We can't even see in the main town. Huh. to do this route with Jesse Eugene Eugene right. oh Eugene <sighs> man he was funny oh yeah Eugene oh that's so clever plus oh she has to go first rewiring electronics and stuff may we all be that sharp at 73 oh May we all make it to 73. Also true. I wonder if he died from natural causes. This is gonna be rough. Huh, <laughs> going prone to go up. I thought she had... Oh, we have our winter boots on. Snakes. Oh. What was this place? Uh, it used to be a radio tower. 
Wait, oh, 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 oh. Ah, uh, yes. I'm surprised. Hey, I'm gonna guess this bong was your jeans. <laughs> <laughs> That's mine. He gave it to me. Oh Do you have any on you, actually? Oh, I wish. Eugene always had some on him. Are they growing it in uh I'm sure, I'm sure. I don't think I saw any like of the of it in the greenhouses, but Eugene 73 just coming back here to the radio tower or radio station just to have a little nice smoke. Survey the area, kill a few infected. There's gotta be a baseball garden here. Uh, oh, that's so clever. October 2013. Mm. Yes, give me that ammo. Do we have two right now, right? We have our, yeah, because she brought her pistol with her. So we have a pistol and a rifle. And we've got the log books. But before we hit that, anything. Uh, I think it is just that. All clear T. All clear D. One runner along the main road. Cleared it. Two clickers by the gas station. Cleared them. Otherwise clear. T and J. All right. And there. Hmm. Nina and Eugene all clear. Found a wild horse stuck in the ice. Got it out. Taking it back to camp. Skipping the next lookout. Dean and Eugene all clear. Jesse and Astrid, one clicker in the basement, cleared it. Greg and Bonnie, dead goat by sunny day's retirement, found three runners inside, cleared them. Dude, they're kicking ass. Greg and Bonnie all clear. Snow's pretty rough, gonna camp here tonight. Jesse and William all clear. And then we've got Dina Eugene, killed three runners outside the suburbs, all clear. Found a dead deer just outside the tower, looks chewed up, but not infected. All clear, bad rainstorm, river ahead flooded. Camping here tonight, then backtracking in the morning. Hmm. Saw footprints. Followed them to a small encampment. Two adults and one child in need of medical attention. We'll be skipping the next lookout and talking, taking them straight to town. All clear, Tommy and Joel. All clear. And then the two clickers by the gas station. And then us. Come here. Town up ahead's our last stop. Take a look. The town up ahead. There's a clock tower. Massive. Oh, it was a ski town. Yeah, yeah. Oh, shh. Uh, it was a ski lodge. <sighs> on Tommy and Joel's route. Yep. That's the one. The one on Tommy and Joel's route? That means that they might be crossing paths with Abby. Let's see a uh, strip mall? Oh, with the supermarket? No, town's past that. No, but here's the thing. Like, we saw him in the trailer uh, meeting up with her so much later. You know? Like, whenever she goes back Here's to Salt Lake. With the big tower thing? Yep. That's where the next lookout is. Mm -hmm. Let's get back to the horses. Unless this isn't when it happens. I see, this is why I don't watch trailers. I think it's like I avoid watching trailers because I do feel like it caught it's a cause for comparison or trying to like read Question. into the game. Were you wearing those same clothes yesterday? A hundred percent. They're clean. No judgment. It's patrol, you know. You're here to kill infected, not to look fancy. True. I didn't go into the bathroom. Thank you. Oh no, I did go into the bathroom. That's where we saw that. Okay. But I feel like there'd have to be a baseball card somewhere. Double back, double back. Hey, Japan. Japan is her horse. Okay, that makes sense. I actually thought she had a dog or something when we saw the sticky note. Mm. Shimmer. Oh, this is so cool. All right. She's able to gallop, but I have to just... <sighs> We're just slowly trotting. I think we 
should go out like Eugene. <laughs> from a stroke? Oh. No. From old age. Like living a long life. I'm glad they answered that. You? No way. Come on. You're way too reckless. Oh, look who's talking. <gasps> You'll probably die from hypothermia from wearing canvas sneakers in the snow. <laughs> I'm wearing boots today. Let's go up here real quick. You know you're gonna die? You let me guess. You're gonna kill me? Hmm. Snowball to the face. <laughs> Did I ruin your punchline? No. Maybe. Fuck you. <laughs> Sorry. <sighs> Trying to see if there's anything to loot. Huh. All right. Try to stay on path more, but I guess we'll actually find stuff probably when it comes to being in town. Speed limit 25. Hey, check these houses out. Seems quiet, but we can if you want. I bet they still got supplies. A hundred percent. Let me in. What do you know about this place? Just another evacuated neighborhood. Uh, I could almost never make it out this far. We usually catch them on the outer perimeter. Interesting. Oh, nice points. Seven. That's such an odd amount. Okay. These trailers are neat. Nice little portable home. <laughs> you think people really traveled a lot in these things? Yeah. Oh, well, wouldn't you? I mean, if I'd lived pre-outbreak, yeah. Pre-outbreak. The whole country. Or traveled to another country. Oh, uh, look, they had a Maybe mini we... bar. <laughs> Keep dreaming. This is a really nice trailer. I mean, Jesse in its prime. What about going to Canada? He said there's these like giant waterfalls out there he wanted to see. Oh, really? Giant. He's such waterfall. a hardcore Jackson guy. Everybody's got their dream. What are you doing tonight? Oh. Uh, I was hmm. thinking of inviting Joel to watch a movie. <laughs> Oh, yeah. Aww. You guys good? Yeah. I need her to come up here so I can hear this dialogue. What are you guys gonna watch? What's Joel into? Uh, Curtis and Viper 2. That's the one that's been on my radar for a while. Joel's oh, into watching wow. whatever she wants to watch, I feel like. Well, we used to watch these cheesy 80s action movies. He's really into them. Yeah. <laughs> no. I actually really like them, too. What about you? <laughs> What are you doing later? Some people were talking about sneaking out. Going sledding. Hold on. Oh, that sounds fun. Yeah. You want to meet up after? Oh. Uh, okay. Santa can wait. Maybe I'll play guitar for you. Okay. Maybe I'll play guitar for you. Dear Santa, I was a good boy this year. Can I please have a big dog? I wanted to keep my daddy safe while he goes hunting okay. for food. It could have also helped protect our house from the monsters. It could have also help me keep company when my daddy closes himself in the bedroom. Aw. Aw. Here's what she looks like. Can you also get me a gun? I think if I was stronger than my daddy... Wait, if I was stronger, my daddy would be happier. Thank you very, very much, Eric. That's what the dog looks like. Oh. Wait, I think it's actually really cute, too, that they took the time to make it look like that was his second attempt. Like he had, you know, like he attempted at first and then he did it again. He had his little practice. What's Curtis and Viper 2 about? Okay, so nice two vanity. former commandos that go rogue to fight bad guys. Mm -hmm. And I think in this one, they go up against Russian spies or something. I'm more interested in this than I thought I would be. <sighs> so the young one, Viper, he's a trained ninja. Over he here. He's a complete badass. So how old is he in the first movie? Uh, ten. Wait, how many Not movies accessible. did they make of this? Uh, I think they made four? Why am I getting, Jeez. like, diehard vibes? I actually saw the last one in the theater. Am I crazy? Yes. Joel saw it in you theater. Think anybody out there is still making huh? movies? Hmm. Has to be. Maybe I don't think. Just like us. Just surviving. Oh, nice. Day. Well, I write new music, so. Someone had a camera. Movies of their hunting explorations. 
Yes. Woo. Let's go. Tesseractor. Oh, one. Isn't it the one of those superhero cards you're all Superhero into? cards. Oh, yeah. All right. The Tesseractor. Brains, 80. Brawn, 60. Well, unknown. Real name unknown. Affiliation Society of Champions, which is who our first person got kicked out of. Appearing one day from out of the blue. No one knows where or when this mysterious transdimensional being came from. Their ability to move in and around four-dimensional space at will has turned the tide in many battles. Though using his power, it leaves them as weak and vulnerable as a newborn. Claiming to have no name, they all were bestowed the nickname the Tesseractor by the Society of Champions. However, some suspect Tesseractor is keeping their true undiscovered identity a secret. He is neutral. Hmm. Wait, hold up. There are original Ellie songs? Oh gosh. Why haven't you played any for me? Well, <laughs> I, I don't know. Come on. Will you play one for me? Tonight. Tonight. <clears throat> I'll think about it. Hmm. Is there a way to call? Uh, let me just pop back on Shimmer and then we can get off later. Or actually, they're keeping up with us. Nice, they're keeping up with us. All right, we can't go up there. There might be one more house to explore. Mm, no, I think that's it. The trailer, the house, and then going up through the window of the other house. Hmm. Wow. The condition of the homes just vary so much. Probably based on the condition before the outbreak, too. What is behind that, though? All right. What are we thinking? Oh, shit. Easy the deer. Oh, shit. Clean carcass infected. you think it would take to bring down a moose? The moose are freaking huge. Where the hell are they? Let's go find them. Oh god. All right. Look, here's the thing. If they're taking out an entire moose, those are not just a small little I would much I don't know what would be I think by far it's probably worse to encounter a bear than a moose, but at the same time More blood. I feel like moose are so aggressive. I wouldn't want to run into either on a trail. I hear Hold on. Some inside. Yep, 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 yep. Dina, this way. Maybe they weren't always infected. What do we got? There's one right here. There she is. All right. Okay, now's the time to figure out if we can sneak kill as Ellie now that she's older. Please be able to. Okay. So we're still not choking them out. We're just... It's down. Yeah, we're just... A little shoo-shoo. Okay, there's gotta be... Let's see if we can get around to the back of the supermarket. Good idea. We're gonna wanna up our listening, but right away, I already feel like the listening is a lot better in this one. Just something about it feels... Ooh. Hmm. Not sure how I feel about that. All right, we've got two paths. We've got this path, and then we've got that one. This one looks like it's housing some loot. Although, wait, hold on. Blood, uh, blood tracks lead over there. Uh, it's locked. And I don't have. Locked doors can usually be open from the other side. Okay, let's try going in here real quick first. Because I do think the blood tracks are going to be where the walkers are at. Yeah, perfect. Oh! <gasps> Money, 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 money. <laughs> money, money, money. Mm, is that really it? <laughs> oh, I'll take that. All right. All right. We gotta take this super slow, although this is gonna alert everyone. It's gotta be so loud. Quick throw. Strike. Okay. 
Okay, so I don't think I ever did that where you yeah. can just quick throw and then yeah yeah strike nice stun to enemies to deal significant damage Thanks. that is sick all right let's make sure we pick the up something came in was barricaded how'd that runner get in here yeah that's a good question all right i see the blood tracks leading up there but hold on let's loot what's the most infected you've ever taken down on patrol hmm it's gotta be the one i had with joel a year or so ago like, sounds right uh, Dozen. Of course, Joel gets the worst one. Cleared about 20 once. There was a group passing through. Fuck. An entire group of infected. We'll get you a new personal record today. Post office? Nothing else. Hmm. All right, well. Yeah, up through the window. But they make a good point. It's like, how did they get. I don't know, have we ever seen them I know they do climb like that, so maybe they were going after someone. Let's keep it quiet. Let's see how it goes. Right now. No, no, no. Alright, she's going after the other one. Big gun. Not bad. All right, I want to avoid using ammo if we can at all costs. Blood tracks lead over towards the dumpster. Hold on. Hold up. That's not a blood track. That is a snack. That is a bottle. Hold on. Got one more in there. Three, it looks like. I feel like a faint one to our three o'clock. I'm going to take him behind here real quick and then stop them. Nice. Hmm. Yeah, two. That one is moving. Alpine traders. Wouldn't mind picking up some skis. Hold what? Yeah, they could go skiing. Like, no. Oh my gosh. I mean, it would be like you'd have to trek up and down because you don't have a ski lift. But why are they not skiing? That would be so much fun. Also, I really like that chandelier. All right. So I'm gonna try, if I can, to sneak kill him, but if I can't, door is barred. All right. Ellie should, ugh. He's gonna turn around. Oh, no, I could have done it. The only problem is there's two of them, so I don't want to... Alright, we're going to go around here real quick. Oh, this was just the other way in. Alright. He should keep going straight, but I actually think it's going to be easier. I think it'd be easier to take this one out. Look at her face when she does that. Okay. Oh, kill him, Dina! Kill him, Dina! Kill him! Okay, what is happening? I'm getting rocked right now. Oh my gosh. Okay, this is why... How many hits does it take to kill them now? She put in multiple bullets, but I don't think it matters if they put in bullets into them. Like, if it's not a scripted one where they're supposed to kill it. Jeez. I don't have a health kit either. That guy was moving too fast. It's okay. I still feel like our sneak is top notch so far. I can come back from this. We can come back. Don't look at me like that. All right, there's nothing over there. Uh, okay. 20% off. <gasps> I'm surprised those hiking boots are still available. Maybe, but yeah, they, I mean, even if it's a display model, they'd have the matching size in the back. So you could still easily get some. Ah! All right, give me that ammo back. I wasted so many shots. Oh, 
stomach. Yeah. I thought there'd be a med kit or something. I wonder if you can punch them back like Abby does. I need to test that. Um, there's a hole in the roof over there. Help a girl out. Here. So far, Sneak has been pretty good, though. Thanks. I can't. I'm gonna drive myself crazy with that. See? All right, let's figure out how to get in there. Mm, we're gonna have to go prone down here. Under here. I don't trust this. This adds another level of s being scared because you'll. Ah! Mm. Mm. Yeah. As I was. Ellie, are you clean? <sighs> yeah. Just banged up. Please die of old age and not because you get infected. Oh gosh, yes. I really don't want to have to shoot you in the face. Uh. <laughs> Deal. Cool. I think also, <laughs> I noticed this earlier, but even when she was at home by herself, which is important because anybody really could walk in, but she always keeps her bite covered up and bandaged it's probably a precaution all the time but i wonder if her friends i know when she would go outside she probably always wears something but you don't think her friends would be like hey why do you still have your arm bandaged up after so long mm. note anything good back there actually yeah nice mom i'm sorry to god for what i did ma'am ma'am mom Mom, ma'am, I wasn't going to hurt you. I didn't want anything from your store except for the drugs. Your husband came at me. What choice did I have? I don't know what accent's coming out while I read this, but <laughs> my little sister stopped feeling her feet. I need the insulin. Everyone is hoarding the stuff. What choice did I have? I hope he survives. I'm sorry. Mm. 26. We can upgrade something. Hold up, wait. Also, I would like to find some stuff to make a bandage. <laughs> Alright, so we have survival crafting. So yeah, so you can upgrade either into survival or crafting. What are we able to purchase? Craft melee upgrades. <laughs> Recipe requires binding blade. <sighs> That's the thing is I, I, I want to keep saving. Let's keep saving to 30. I think there's some good stuff at 30. Hmm. All right, so we're trying to get up there. Mm, let's go through here now. Uh, oh, is that a toolbox? Oh, no, just parts. I am extremely low on health. All right, so get up there, up there. Hmm. All right, run and jump like we learned. This way. Run and jump. I wonder why we haven't seen nearly as many like cloth or or things to help us heal. You know. I'm in. I'm in. Pie charts. Gross what? Gross profit. Gross margins. Here we go. All right, nice. Grab this. Goals for Q4. But this isn't actually. Oh. Hey, got some alcohol. Yes. A couple of rags. Here, fix yourself up. Ah, uh, they probably do that intentionally because I think we lost health also from the guy attacking us on the ground right there. I think they're still offering you a slight tutorial. I mean, they are, because they showed us how to do stuff with um, the other girl. I feel like the Last of Us tutorials have always been so subtle. I see spores in there. Mask's on. Got it. Mask on. 
Right. So I talked about this in the trailer, though. So she puts a mask on probably just to keep up the ruse that it doesn't impact her. I don't want to have to shoot you in the face. <laughs> oh, that's so sweet. All right, we're going through Only here first. Mean they've been here for a while. Oh, shit. This might be the right Everybody's way to go. For older infected. I, uh, this is either the right way or the side way. I don't know. I think we're above it. Let's mm. get to the ground floor. <gasps> you guys, it's time. My time has come. Okay. Y'all ready? Hold on. We're going to try to do the safe. Yo, Kristen. Left the real shit in the safe for you. Combo is the date my good boy got employee of the month. Don't effing care. Don't sell those or give them away. That's for your back, all right? Feel better, Mina. Oh, look at the dog. Unless the employer of the month is like right out here, but let me open this. But it's a fun game. And ever since you guys told me it in the first one, I wonder if that was something that they, they kept on the second one. All right, y'all ready for this? Okay, it's seven. Thirteen. Hold on. How high up does this thing go? What? Oh, it's going all the way back down naturally? What? Okay, it's going back to 50, so I missed it? Hold on. No. No. Oh, I know we did it that one time. It's going to crush me. That's definitely it. That's definitely it. Oh, you know what? Let's try starting down at the bottom, maybe. Like down at here. Oh, no. So I don't know what it's doing when it's ticking back all the way down here. I think because... Oh. Hold on. There. This last one's just really hard to tell. Let me try going all the way down. Oh, it's freaking out on me again. Okay, it puts me back down to 50. I know the first two ones are right. I know it'll take me a second to find out employee of the month, though, if I go back out here. So give me a second. Yeah, employee of the month. September 2013. Hold on. So is it just 2013? September... Yeah, yeah. So what did he say? It's just the month of his... So it's just 20 and then 13. Oh, that's so weird. Okay. So, okay, hold on. So we knew it was seven, because that's September. So I heard that click. Heard that click. I think it's going to be... It would be how you would write the date, though. So it'd be seven, and then what if this is 20, and then the other one's 13? 
So I'm hearing the tick for 13, but it's in the wrong placement. That's why. Yeah, that's why, because I'm hearing it in 2013. That's funny. Ah, oh, that's why. Mm, it was close. It was so close. I just was lost with that last one. And I should have, I guess I knew at some point I was telling myself, I was like, it can't go beyond 30 because it can't go, one of them can't go beyond 12. Then you've got the month. I don't know. We tried. Well, there's always another one, you know? There's always the next one. We lost this round, but it's not over yet. Mm. Thank goodness. We'll finally start collecting these now that we've learned to craft our med kits. Oof. So many level up points. 48. Faster health. I want this. 60. I kind of want Endure first. Just because you guys know, I'm trying to... Trying to predict, uh, these incoming deaths here. Ellie! Oh! 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 Oh. Oh no. Oh no. We gotta go. Ouch. All right, stealth kill clickers with your switchblade sneak up and press. All right, here we go. I know what you guys are saying. Oh gosh. Oh gosh, no! The first clicker kill of the game! I forgot that you have to move so slow, don't you? And yeah, now we can block the incoming attacks. <sighs> okay, so if I stun her, do, can I still get the... I know, the sneak up kills. I hate doing sneak up kills on them because it's so loud. No matter what you do, push lightly. That's what it is, is it's like push lightly and I'm like, I'm pushing lightly. <laughs> This is me pushing lightly. <laughs> that was me pushing lightly. Also, it's not, it's throwing me off with Dina's flashlight. I'm like, turn it off. I don't care what you tell me. I don't care if they don't get alerted by it. I don't trust it. Just grab that little rifle ammo. You know, just do our looting as we're going along. Where is it? Okay, it's over there. Ah, I hate these pharmacy and drug stores. This is where all of the bad shit happens. Okay. All right, here we go. Press forward. Lightly. Lightly. Okay, she's gonna turn around. So hard not to freak out. Look at the way that the detail on the flooring do. All right, so she's gonna come back here and when she walks that way, then we're gonna come out and just grrr, grab her. <sighs> uh, Dina. Oh, right. Thank you, Dina. <laughs> Thank you, Dina. I missed the stealth clock. Did you her? Yes. Nice. Stab her in the neck. <sighs> okay. I'm by. Fuckers make my skin crawl. Yeah. I'm by sure no. Cleared out. By no means expecting to. Fuck out of here. Speak in my language. Do like perfectly. In combat compared to the first one, I'm just looking for a slight improvement. So as long as I see a little bit of improvement, I'm happy with my performance in this game. Push it. Dina, a little help. Come in. A little help. Uh, 
employees only. <laughs> Weston's is typically good clearing job. Uh, I feel like Weston's like and the pharmacies are great for getting I'll the pills, though. Please tell me she's making me a Molotov. Ellie. Uh huh. Uh huh. Oh. Here. Thanks. Molotov set fire to an area. Careful with that. I'm a pro. I'm a pro. Also true. We're not done. All right, we've got plenty more. Grab this. Grab that. Grab these. I know, toggle my flashlight. Wait, was that 12? Okay. Oh. Y'all. Ender. But it's locked. So why is it locked? Is it because... Oh, no way. Do you have to go in order? You have to go in order? I... Huh. Also... Hmm... Craft all items twice as quickly. The skill is locked until you acquire the prerequisite weapon. I think it might be locked, so we're just gonna test it. Wait. Apprentice. Gotcha, 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 gotcha. Okay, yeah, so it unlocks as you go. Ah. You have to get them. Oh, I'm not sure how I feel about that. It's not the worst thing in the world, but it's... Of course. Course. Got some numbers here. Yeah. This might be bigger than Joel's takedown with her. The 12 that they took down together. Okay, clicker is the most important. We've got that must be the clicker right there. We've got this one right here. But I'm worried about the clicker that's moving up towards us. And the clicker right there. Back it up. Mm, clicker keeps walking forward. We got this. Absolutely not. Absolutely not. I'm very tempted to just toss a Molotov, you guys. L... This one. Keep walking forward. Come on. Keep pressing forward. Okay, my goal is to do this entire section stealthy. I gotta redeem myself. Redemption inbound. Full on ammo. It's the... The normal infected that are actually a little bit more terrifying because if they do see you, it feels like it's easier to alert them, you know? Oh, I might if I do. Okay. Maybe she'll walk back here. All right, we've got two in this area. Those two are together, so I think there's a total of three. Clicker and two more runners. Mmm. I need her to come back over in this area. So when she rounds this corner, we'll stab her. Yeah, this is the way. Oh, shit. I'm gonna have to chase her a little bit. Where's the clicker at? Okay, clicker's not gonna notice if we grab her. But her buddy will notice. Buddy's, buddy's got eyes on. Buddy's got eyes on, buddy's alerted. Damn it! Okay. Oh, run, 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 run! Ellie, no! Why am I so bad with that? I, I know that he's gonna see me. I guess there's a huge part of me that, like, feels like it's very temperamental because there have been cases where we have taken down ones that are so much closer in the vicinity and they don't notice, you know? So it's just so temperamental. <sighs> All right, let's take this one out then, before her buddy sees. Okay. Come on, keep walking forward. No, because that guy will see. Ah, okay, so they're gonna do the same rotation that we just dealt with, but instead, 
We need to maybe go for that guy first. Or wait for her to... Okay, this is what we're gonna do. Instead of grabbing her in the open, let's wait until she walks behind this. Or we can always throw a bottle. Okay. Wait to see where she goes from here. Please come around here. Walk her behind here, walk her behind here. Stealth kill. Okay, we need to get out of this situation. Her friend's coming. Okay, he's right here. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. All right, he's gonna continue his rotation over there. I'd rather kill him before we kill the clicker because the clicker is not gonna see us. Whereas if he, we start killing the clicker, he's gonna spot us possibly. So let's start. Mm. It actually, I will say, I think I'm less irritated by deaths and more like, all right, how can I improve what I did wrong there? Like, what's the way around this? All right, I'm gonna rotate all the way around. I see something, rag. Okay, so if he comes over here, this will be good because the clicker is not gonna notice it. Yes, yes, don't look at my gun. Except the clicker is coming over here. Nice, choke him out or stab him out. Okay. Here we go. Now I just have to flawlessly sneak up on this clicker. Easy. Let's go ahead and uh, craft. I'm just gonna pop back down there real quick. All right, I think I can find a snack bar, so I don't think I need to waste the, uh, I don't need to waste the med kit yet. Right, let's go this way, let's go this way. I feel like this way is safer. You just have to move so slow with them, and I'm not good at lightly tapping the... Nice! Got it, got it, got it! Let's go! Let's go! <laughs> Alright, that was awesome. That was awesome. Alright. Look at the body. Should be all of them. Not bad. Not all of them! Not all of them! <laughs> right? Right? Okay. This is a lesson to myself to do. Are you still moving? <gasps> uh, nope. Okay. Okay. You know what? I'm impressed with us. Yeah. Yeah. Man, How many was that? Believe our numbers. No kidding. Okay. Let's go to the next lookout. Mm. Take a fucking break. And take a break. Was there something there? Yes. Agreed. All right, next lookout and take a break. Can't open that. They have an A rating. Mm. I just feel like there's got to be a baseball card here. Or a superhero card. Keep saying baseball cards. It's just all right, let's run around, see where we can loot like one or two more things, if anything. Nothing on the shelves, nothing down below. Produce is out. Maybe something on the shelves. Up, oh, up, up, up. Body. All right, I think that's pretty much it. It's a fairly uh, sparse grocery store. Won't budge. Hmm. Okay, here's what we're gonna do. You're just gonna hurl me up through that hole in the roof. <laughs> okay. Mm -hmm. It's interesting seeing her relationship with um Cable here. Nice. With here we go. Dina versus um I should hold us. Why am I blinking on her name? Ah, have I? It hasn't even been that long. Hold on, let me aim real quick. Get over. Nice. Yeah. I want to say. 
Okay, that's good. Okay. Here I go. Oh, this cannot be good. Bananas. Okay. Get out of here. How am I blinking on her name? I want to say Abigail, and that's not it. Why am I thinking Abigail? Now I have the Abby stuck in my head. Hmm. Over here. Okay, we need to get back to the horses. Oh. Really no or not, that seems brutal. How far are we from the lookout? Just past the next town. Following this is going to be rough. Okay, so yeah, now we're finally back, I think, in the corresponding, like, the same time as Abby. Or is... How far away are we? A few minutes out. Okay. A few minutes out. Oh. Mmm, it's about to happen. This is getting worse. Yeah. We turn back. And we stay at the supermarket? It. We're almost there. So is a I know, girl. I know. Keep going. Did we just lose her? She Dina, just ran ahead of her. us. Dina, come on. No. Dina! How did she just fly in front of us like that? Oh, I'm gonna go straight. Dina, where are you? What the heck? Dina! I'm so lost. Okay, we're back here. I went straight. Those are my tracks there. Let's go this way. Ellie, Ellie this way. Ellie. I hear her. Okay. Ellie. Oh, thank God. Come on. This, this way. way. Where are we going? Just trust me. We're going somewhere where we wouldn't have gone on our normal trek, I bet. Because of the storm, it diverted us. Oh, no. Library. Get inside. Take the horses inside. Okay. Okay, this isn't so bad, right? I'll get the door. Okay. You been here? Rode by it. Never came inside. Probably should clear it first then. All right, let's make sure it's clear. Yeah. All right, this might be the spot that... Hmm. I feel like we're on the cusp of, like, the game-defining cinematic part where it's going to completely change the direction of our... Uh, of our life here in a second, and I just feel it in my bones, and so I don't want to stop yet because I know. I know it's coming up. Gosh, I don't know. Even though I was wrong about so many. It doesn't feel like anyone's been here in a while. Shit. I gotta see what's back there. We need to go up through something. Oh, just the glass is already broken. Mm, we're not gonna be able to push that over. Uh, it's not gonna allow me to break the glass, so we just need to go through. Oh, yeah, break glass. Mmm. Yikes. All right, grab all of these. Here? All this Go ahead stuff? and open that. This has to be Eugene. Pick up another bottle. Are you sure? Yeah, nobody else would tinker with this shit. Eugene was messing Why around with stuff here. Me? Probably because he had a bunch of upgrade parts. Are you kidding me? No. Spark. Um. I know I was so wrong on a lot of predictions with the trailer, but it's still, it's like, I don't know if I should be doing that because I just need to ignore it. You know, I think that's what I have to do is just don't even refer to it. Eugene Linden. Definitely Eugene's place. He was a firefly. 
Is this a firefly? He served with Tommy. Hmm. That makes sense. I had no idea. Yeah. They got into some real dark shit. So we're... He said he blew up a checkpoint at Denver QZ. Jeez. Killed three soldiers. And two civilians. Jesus. Sounds like he we're also still... told me that he and Tommy slow tortured some big Fedra general. I don't know. I, I don't buy Tommy doing that though. He could do worse. Journal entry added. He and Joel did a lot to survive after the outbreak. Yeah. Was Eugene in touch with the other fireflies? Did he hear about me and Joel? No, he wouldn't have said he would have said something. I think he was out of the fireflies before, right? But also there's a lot of mention of this Eugene guy. So I find that to be l pretty interesting. Um, it looks like we will be collecting firefly pendants as well. But they're doing a lot of mentioning with him. Lauren, what's that? Wait, wait, a trading card. Oh, it didn't allow me to. Re oh, that's so weird. OK, this is Laurent. Laurent. I'm so cult. I'm not saying that right at all. Uh, brains 100, brawn 20, all brains, no brawn. <laughs> Affiliation spark. That's the first time we've heard that one. Born with a brilliant mind, but hobbled by numerous physical ailments, Laurent spent many formative years in hospitals, earning his MD, PhD at the age of 15. He developed a cure for his rare genetic disease, the patients for which made him a multi-millionaire overnight. Oh, the patents for, sorry. Within a few short years, he turned millions into billions, giving him the capital to build the sci tech empire spark and free reign to pursue knowledge and progress at any cost. Rumors circulated that spark has developed methods to infuse newborns with specific superpowers, but Foucault, Foucault, Foucault has denied these ridiculous claims. He is a villain. Flip it back over. We flip it over. Oh, we are a full villain? <sighs> full villain. Oh, that's so cool. Look at all the comic books she could have grabbed. No. Oh, she's looking at other stuff too. Must have been a daycare. Hmm. Plenty of TVs to loot, that's for sure. Is this a place to craft, maybe? Mm. Let's go. Oh my god. Oh no, it's not. It's Tommy and Eugene. <laughs> they look like babies here. Okay, why does Eugene look like Jason Momoa or whatever, like Aquaman up in here? <laughs> also, Tommy? Peters. There's gotta be a generator around here somewhere. I thought it was gonna be our tool box. Lights. There's a generator. Okay. This is where he was crashing a lot of times. He made his own, oh, here we go. Here we go. Eugene, I'm begging you to come home. The Fireflies want to save the world. I say let them. He left his family to join the Fireflies. Let Harsh. them go after the military. Eugene. The politicians. Let them develop a vaccine to save mankind. But maybe one day we'll live to see the fruits of their fantasies. Until then, I have to put our daughter first. The Fireflies will be fine without you. Your daughter won't. She keeps asking me when you're coming home, and I can't lie to her anymore. I miss you, but I don't know how much more of this I can take. Come home, please. We love you, Claire. Aww. He did leave them. Hey, generator. Found the generator. Hmm. Is he gonna, oh, here's a, no, that's not a workbench. Okay, I keep thinking I'm going to find a workbench, but never mind. All right, let's start this. Oh, shoot. It's been so long since I've done it. One more. Nice. Oh, that's butter. Oh, wow. Oh, impressive workbench, Eugene. It did look like a workbench. You mod your gun with this gear. Very nice. We have so many gears, too. The bits and bobs. All right, so we got the semi-auto pistol and then the bolt-action rifle. Not a big fan of the bolt-action, although if we could get a scope, 
we'd be kind of doing a little bit better. All right, let's see what we got. Capacity, I can't put into recoil. Stability, <laughs> y'all know which one I'm gonna go into. Stability. I'm a tinker. I have to go stability. I need it, my weapon sway is disgusting. It's the small arms. Yeah, this'll work. I love how she pushed it back off. All right, it's not allowing me to shoot that off. Oh, Dina. Why, hello there. Oh, hello. A heater? Oh. Ellie, look at the floor. What There's the no stuff down there. You see a way down? Um, uh, not here. Follow where the cord goes. Or if not through there. Yep, check it out. We've got light even coming from over here. I feel like this isn't going to be good. This is a lot of secrets for one person to have. Uh, although... What's he got down here? Well, it's obviously a sex den. <laughs> That's why he didn't tell you about it. I hope it's a sex den. For his sake. Mm. He's so lonely, man. Aww. He did leave his wife and kids, so... Oh... Oh my god. You've got to be kidding me. It's weed. That's a lot of dead weed. This explains a uh, lot. Right. She did say he always had weed on him. Why am I getting like a emotional moment when I'm surrounded by marijuana? Hey. Getting like very tender thing? music happening. Huh. Brandy's cooch. Are these? It's porn. <laughs> Interesting. Smash Please, Brandy's. We went full adult themes. Full adult themes today. Maria would lose her shit if she saw this place. How'd he get this together? Must have taken him forever. <sighs> I wish he'd told me about this. I could have helped him out. Wow. I guess it is all dead, isn't it? Damn. How long has he been dead for? Oh, stop. I'm yeah. just trying to figure out what happened to this game. Like, how did we... Mask bong. God, he was so smart. <laughs> I think what's happening here is I'm just so used to our very, um serious tones and themes and then all of a sudden i feel like there's like i i got our joke book here and there right like we had the joke book time and time again but now i just feel like it's i don't know it's hard to not like take this as like a joke right now hmm blunt ah mm. probably take that back with them oh there we go you think it's still good? Does weed go bad? Hmm. <laughs> find out. How we've grown from playing around innocently in the mall with water guns to a smoke and some yeah, marijuana. I oh, I got it. <clears throat> Fuck. Give me that. Oh, yeah. Like you're gonna get it. This is like, I feel like we're genuinely okay. getting to see her grow up. Yeah. You know, like, this is the, like, later teen years where we're... Oh, fuck it. Oh! What the fuck is wrong with you? I got it open, didn't I? She did. That looks like the... <laughs> just a screaming Carhartt vest on her. This smells good. I mean... We struck here a while, right? Some suggestive eyes. Don't be trapped. Look at Ellie's face. Can I ask you a question? Oh, God. Okay. I don't know. Can you? Scale of one to ten. Oh, here we go. One being, like, 
absolute trash. And 10 being life-altering. How would you rate our kiss from last night? 11. <laughs> Why are we still talking about this? You said it was a mistake. That's true. Did I say that? What are you doing? I asked you to rate our kiss. Dina, it feels like she plays games. I don't know. I want to like her. Mm. And I'm happy to see Ellie happy. If that's what makes her happy. But I just feel like Dina's playing games. Give it a six. A six? Wow. Like a solid six. Okay. There are a lot of people around. Yeah, but six. Oh. oh. What? <laughs> I mean, now I really want to know how you'd rate it. Well, now I'm not going to genuinely be able to do it because you said six. I'm not going to be like 10 now that you've said I suck at kissing. You're infuriating. Have you met you? <laughs> you make me want to go back outside. Oh god, it's like I like it, but the cheesy dialogue. It's like kind of cheesy dialogue. It's like the banter. This better be better than a six. Wait, did we put it out? Oh god. <laughs> She's gonna give it a 10. I don't think I'm gonna think about Kat anymore. I'm pretty sure she's not thinking about Jesse anymore either. All right, so I wonder if more time lapses after that, but no, because Abby's out there. Or that girl's out there. We don't know if that's Abby. I keep throwing the name Abby and I'm pretty sure I'm probably wrong. Oh no, we're back to playing Abby. Yo! <laughs> All right, okay, okay. I know exactly how to define this scene, you guys. I know exactly how to define this scene. Okay. Okay, this is how I feel about this. Oh man. Okay, this is how I feel about... <laughs> That's a good stopping point for the part one as well. But okay, do you guys remember? So we've seen Ellie kind of grow up in a lot of ways. Like, yeah, when we met her, she was still a teenager. But I guess because we saw her through the lens of Joel, I saw her like be probably being younger than she was while still being so wise for her age. And it's not the same thing. But I guess for me, like when we saw her relationship with her, um, her friend from the mall. Why am I blanking on her name? I know you guys are going to totally say it in the comments, but I'll remember after this because I'll look it up. But when we were hanging out with her, um, when they had their kiss, like I was like, OK, got it. But like it also still there was something like innocent about it. And so I feel like this one, it's like, remember when we started watching Game of Thrones and then you get to season eight and you see Maisie Williams and you're like, I watched you grow up. And then you're like, no, I don't. It's not that I don't want to see it. It's just that it's like, I always forget just how much older Ellie is, you know? And I wonder if that is distorted because we played as Joel. And so I saw her as like our daughter and our younger person. Not that I don't think that ever happens. I get it. That's just parenting. But I feel like that's where I was like, oh, okay. So there were a lot of like, you see those adult themes, even her joking and stuff like that. Like she's matured so much in the past four years. And it's a good thing. It's just like, a wow, like, but there's got to be a significance for that too. Um, I mean, I definitely like we've known that like between her relationship with, which I wonder why they just briefly, I mean, I guess they just briefly mentioned Kat, but I I also am worried too, because from everything we know about Dina, she seems to play games. Like that's the only thing I worry about, but I guess, you know, Ellie's liked her for a while based on the journal. So I'm happy for her, but it's just this like, ah, uh, I feel like I'm still playing as Joel, even though we play as her right now. And now we're playing as this girl and ah, uh, our little Ellie is growing up and I have to come to terms with that. I have to come to terms. But all right, initial impressions outside of that. Uh, a lot of cool stuff is happening. I feel like we are setting the grounds for a really great game here. I personally have loved all of the additional things that we've seen that we haven't really got or we didn't have in the first one. We haven't seen a lot of Joel, which we know right now, as of right now, we know that Ellie and Joel are kind of on the outs. So I'm going to be very interested to see why like what that kind of stemmed from so what's going on there um although she did say that she thought about inviting him over for 
a movie. So clearly they're not, it's not something that's like unmendable. I guess that's probably like how I would put it. It seems like possibly she found out the truth about the fireflies. And then we have this vagueness going on. We're now playing as somebody who clearly has ill um, intentions towards one of the members in that. And that leads me to assume Joel considering the situation. So I'm trying to figure out who this girl is and what we did to possibly piss her off. And that leads to me to the conclusion that obviously we probably killed somebody who meant something to them or which could be Marlene. Honestly, it could be Marlene now that I think about it. I don't know. Ah, I was so wrong with the trailer, you guys. And then I also think I'm doing a little bit better with the combat than I was before now that I'm, you know, reacclimated to the game. There's been a couple, a couple kills that shouldn't have happened. Or they did happen because of my lack of uh, patience. But I still, I totally take those and I'm going to keep learning from them. But I'm having a lot more fun with the combat in this one. And I also just, I think how they've structured the story so far is building you up for like ah, just the slow burn at the beginning and it's gonna I know that there's gonna be that one defining scene that we saw in the trailer and then it's gonna be fast paced after that I really think it's gonna go fast um but yeah guys I hope y'all enjoyed this first part let me know how you enjoyed it um like I kind of a. Uh... <laughs> Like I alluded to at the beginning, I know that there's going to be a lot of, I think, spoilers thrown into the comments. So as always, if you've made it this far, please assist, like abstain from doing any spoilers if you would. Um, I try to read a lot of the comments section and I just don't want to, I don't want it to ruin anything. So I know this one has been very controversial. So I'm definitely interested to see how you guys liked it. Overall, it seemed like a lot of you guys wanted to see me play this. So I'm going to keep on at it and I hope you guys enjoyed this first part and I will see y'all in the next video. Bye. 